thing is, every successful person you know has failed at what they love to do before. Um, I've been unsuccessful uh, in my career. Uh, you just didn't know about it because I wasn't famous yet and I was trying to be famous. I was trying to get a record deal for six years and I kept getting uh, turned down. And any successful person you know, even though it seems like everything just happened for them, uh, it usually was preceded by a bunch of failure, uh, or at least a significant amount. But the great ones aren't the ones that don't fail, they're, they're the ones that learn from their failure and they keep going and they're persistent and they're tenacious. You, you gotta be great at whatever you're doing. Uh, even if you're not known for it yet, you have to be developing into someone who can be great. And you know, if you read Malcolm Gladwell, for instance, he believes you have to practice 10,000 hours to be a genius at any, any particular field. And I don't know if the exact number is right, but I'm sure uh, the, directionally that's correct, that you need to spend a hell of a lot of time doing something uh, and practicing at it and getting better at it uh, for you to be great. And uh, for a songwriter or a singer, that means writing, that means listening, that means performing, that means practicing, that means all of those things. And if you're not doing that, you're not going to become great at it.